Let's take a look at Sarah's fleece. Just opened it up. Opening it up. Taking a look. Seeing some crimp. Let me show that to you. Nice white crimp. Fold this all out. These are unwanted fibers right here. We'll pull out. I'm going to set the camera down so I can pull that off. Okay, just going around the edges, pulling things that don't look the same, meaning... I've got this gorgeous stuff, and then I have this. This is going to go into seconds, does not belong. And I just kind of go around and pick the edges. And then we have some of this harder that you can see, too. Just doesn't belong. That one I'll probably throw in the trash. I'm just going around checking for unwanted hairs. And that I don't want the prime coat, but would probably fit fine for the seconds, which is good for the needle felters. I'm just coming around. Checking the edges. Trying to make these fleeces as clean and as desirable as possible. They're absolutely gorgeous fleece anyway, but the VM isn't really desirable. Okay, let's helicopter over this. This nice bright white. I'm not seeing, I'm seeing shine. I'm not seeing second cuts. This might be an undesirable. I'll just take it out. Very rainy season, so you can see on the tips, they're kind of wet, but they'll wash out as soon as you wash. I wish you could feel this so soft. Take a look at the underside, see it was rainy. Those will just wash out pretty clean under there. Okay, so I'll take another look-see when I'm not holding the camera, and then I'll, I'll start pulling it apart and putting it in the tumbler so that you can see where it goes from there. I think some of that can be pulled out as well. So I'll get right back with you. Now I'm seeing some second cuts here, and what I mean by second cuts is that they're very small little pieces that if you're spinning, they'll make a bump, which you might want a bump, you might want not want a bump. Here's another little tiny piece. These are all undesirable fibers, so we'll pull those out. Little short pieces that you don't want in your fibers. All right, this is Sarah. The alpaca's name is Sarah. And I've skirted it, gone through, and pulled out all of the unwanted fibers, the um, VM, shook the um, skirting tray a little bit to get the unwanted dirt that you can see under here um, that's come out. So now we're gonna put it in the tumbler, which we have right beside here. Uh, you can see the dowels inside there as I turn it. Here's the opening. Again, you can see the dowels and what that's going to do is open the fibers uh, quite a bit and then it will also continue to shake the fibers out. So let me go ahead and prepare some for you so you can take a look at that. 
All right, all I'm doing is pulling the pieces apart. Again, further letting the dirt and dust fall to the table. Uh, what we've done is we've put them on pasture grass, nice green pasture grass for some time before shearing. And then on shearing day, we actually take a vacuum, put it up in the loft with a long hose and let that um, suck up some of the dirt. Oh, I always like finding some beautiful crimpy stuff like that. And then I'm taking it and actually throwing it into the, eh, can't really get it there, tumbler. So I've got a few pieces in there. There, now you can see it. There's a few pieces in there. And I'm going to go ahead and fill it up some, and then I'll show you again. And then I'll turn the fiber, or the, the tumbler on so you can see the fibers, uh, how they get all tumbled up and further more dust and debris gets thrown out. Another thing we like to do is um, check it for tenderness. So we'll take a little piece of fiber from the middle in several different spots and we pull it apart and give it some tension. See there? Uh, if it was brittle, it would just slide apart. This is very good. It's, it's snapping, it's hard, it's firm. And so that would be a piece of uh, that would be a piece of information you would want to know about your fiber. This is Sarah, and she's got good tight, uh, uh, no breakage. All right, this is Sarah in the tumbler. Uh, we have lots to go. Just wanted to show you how full the tumbler is. And then watch this. Look how much is still on the skirting table. All of this is Sarah still to go. She's a nice, full, dense girl. Lots of fiber still to go into the tumbler. Just give you a good idea of what we have here. And here's what we have in the tumbler. Here you can see Sarah has filled the tumbler. The dowels will then, as it rolls around, will um, open up the fibers a little bit more. You can see that just by skirting and separating, picking it, you can see the dirt underneath the skirting tray. Lots of dirt has fallen off. We don't really want to mail that if we're mailing it, and you don't really want to work with it. It gets in your nose, but for the most part, it's a very clean fleece. So let's see the tumbler. The lid has been placed on the tumbler. The latch is closed it, and then it's motorized. So there's a motor over here that I just kind of flip on 